Prince Harry, 33, and Meghan, 36, will say I do at St. George's Chapel at Windsor Castle on May 19, after announcing their engagement in November. On their wedding day, Venus, the planet of love, will move into Cancer, the zodiac sign representing home and family. In addition to the planetary movement, Saturn and Pluto will both be in retrograde at the time of the royal wedding. Interestingly, when Saturn is in retrograde, it is considered the perfect time to work on any father issues which may be ideal for Meghan and her dad. Although it has been reported that her father, Thomas Markle, plans to attend the wedding and give her away, the two have been estranged for many years. Even the stars and the planets will be aligned for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal wedding, which will take place during a significant planetary movement in two retrogrades. The 33-year-old royal and the 36-year-old suit star will say I do at St. George's Chapel at Windsor Castle on May 19, 2018 and the date couldn't be more perfect, astrologically speaking. On their wedding day, Venus, the planet of love, will move into Cancer, the zodiac sign representing home and family. Janet Booth, a Connecticut-based astrologist who helps couples pick their wedding dates, told Bustle that the movement of Venus into Cancer is a great astrological merger for a couple who wants to focus on family. When Venus and Cancer get together, it creates the potential for greater intimacy, according to Tarot.com. It also brings out an appreciation for family and a connection to your roots. The timing couldn't be better, as it has been been reported that Meghan is planning to break tradition and deliver her own speech at their wedding reception, where the bride usually refrains from speaking. It is said that she will be paying tribute to her new husband, Prince Harry, while thanking their friends and family for their support. In addition to the planetary movement, Saturn and Pluto will both be in retrograde at the time of the royal wedding. Retrograde is an astrological phenomenon that occurs when a planet's orbit intersects with Earth's and it appears to be moving backwards in the sky. Identical twin sisters Afira and Tali Edith, who are known as the Astro Twins, explain on their site astrostyle.com that astrology followers can attest to feeling the effects of retrograde planets, even if it is just an illusion. The areas that a retrograde planet rules can become weak, challenging or troublesome during the cycle, they explain. Saturn goes into retrograde on April 17th while Pluto's retrograde starts on April 22nd. Both of them will stay in retrograde until September. According to Astro Twins, Saturn in retrograde is a time to rethink your goals and career path, something that Meghan has undoubtedly already started doing. In November, following her engagement, it was that she was leaving the hit legal drama suits after the show's seventh season. She also confirmed that she would be retiring from acting to focus on her royal duties. I don't see it as giving anything up I just see it as a change, she said during her first joint engagement interview with Prince Harry. Saturn and retrograde is also a time to work through father issues, which may be of benefit to Meghan on her wedding day. Her father Thomas Markle is reportedly determined to walk her down the aisle, and while it is clear she has lots of love for him, their relationship has been fraught over the years. Indeed, Meghan and her father have effectively been estranged for a number of years, with her sister Samantha Grant speaking out earlier this year to reveal that she believes the rift was caused by Meghan's mother Doria. Samantha also insisted during an interview earlier this month that Meghan should provide financial support to Thomas, who has been suffering from a leg injury in recent months. Meanwhile, Plot, 